Netanyahu tells Emmanuel Macron, Paris is the capital of France, Jerusalem is the capital of Israel. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu told French President Emmanuel Macron, Paris is the capital of France, Jerusalem is the capital of Israel, as they met in Paris amid heightened tensions in the West Bank. Mr. Macron and Mr. Netanyahu conceded that they held opposing views on U.S. President Donald Trump's decision to recognize Jerusalem as Israel's capital during a joint press conference on Sunday. The French president reaffirmed his disapproval of Mr. Trump's controversial move, saying the U.S. had unilaterally recognized something that is not complying with the international law. However, Mr. Netanyahu, who has previously celebrated Mr. Trump's declaration, told Mr. Macron the city had been the capital of Israel for 3,000 years. Mr. Macron appealed for calm in the Middle East and asked the Israeli premier to give peace a chance by offering a gesture to Palestinians, such as a settlement freeze on the West Bank. Mr. Netanyahu said, Paris is the capital of France, Jerusalem is the capital of Israel it has been the capital of Israel for 3,000 years and the capital of the Jewish state for 70 years. We respect your history and choices and we know that France will respect ours. I think this is essential for peace, what peace requires is to be built on a foundation of truth, on the facts of the past and the present. This is the only way you can be realistic and build a successful future. Mr. Trump's recognition of Jerusalem as the capital of Israel has stoked tensions across the Middle East, leading to widespread protests and unrest, as well as condemnation from key U.S. allies in Europe and the Arab world. Lebanese security forces fired tear gas at demonstrators outside the U.S. Embassy in Beirut on Sunday, while the Arab League has called on Mr. Trump to reverse his decision. At least two people died and 200 were injured during clashes between Israeli forces and Palestinian protesters on the Israel-Gaza border on Friday. And in Jerusalem on Sunday, an Israeli security guard was targeted in a stabbing attack at the city's central bus station. Israeli police spokesman Mickey Rosenfeld said the guard was seriously wounded and his attacker arrested. The Majin David Adam Medical Service said a 30-year-old male suffered a stab wound to his upper body. Ahead of Mr. Netanyahu and Mr. Macron's joint news conference, Turkey's President Recep Tayyip Erdogan often occurred.